Allah made me Muslim, Allah made me queer, and I'm grateful for both that being queer and Muslim is possible. Instead of saying, why me, God? Why did you make me queer and Muslim? What if I turned that around and said, thank you, God, like Alhamdulillah, and expressed gratitude? And in reframing it that way, it's gratitude. It's not a loathing moment. So when I came out to myself as actually a lesbian when I was younger, it almost was like, Oof, this is how I think heterosexuals know they're straight. Like, this is, this is who I am. But then I did start to like worry about my family is never going to accept this. The same way if I was 14 and straight and wanted a boyfriend, I could never talk to them about that either. We never talked about sexual activity or identity or sexual agency. I just assumed that I would have to be quiet and silent about it. The truth is they're not really that okay with it, but the not okay from what I started with to where I'm at now is world's difference. And interestingly, I love the version of not okay with it that they are. Some of us take the Quran literally, some of us don't take it literally. Quran is meant to be a kind of evolving living text that's now that's being revisited. And you can take any line and that line can be interpreted very differently. There are places that we pull from to get answers or normalize or also demonize, you know, queerness and gender nonconformity. As somebody who's made it to 35, and that's not an old age at all, but I remember being 12, 13, 16, I never thought I would make it to 25. And it wasn't because of any particular or one reason, it was just because I had never known somebody who was 25 and over, from my family, from my background, living this permutation of identity. And so I just assumed that maybe I would poof, I would disappear or something, but if you don't actually ever seen, if you've never seen somebody living a life that wasn't the way your mom and your grandparents and your aunts and your uncles and your grandfather, you know, everyone else did, you just don't think you'll exist. Every single day and every single birthday actually is a really lovely moment to be like, I made it one step, look, I did something out of my own desire and intention setting. <laughs>